Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Uh, first, I'll address this video by saying um, I'm just getting over laryngitis. It's been exactly a week. I absolutely had zero voice last week. And um, anyway, so I've been to the doctor's laryngitis. There's not much I could do. He basically said to slap some tape over your mouth and be quiet. But clearly my doctor does not know me very well. <laughs> So anyway, I apologize. I do have a drink next to me with some ice in it. So if you do hear me, I may have to take a sip. Um, this has just been going on for almost the whole month of November. Start off with a flu, head cold, chest cold, laryngitis, and now I have a sinus infection. But at least it's shifted from the left to the right. So at least we have some progress. All right, you guys, I apologize for that little rant there at the beginning, but I just wanted to get it out there. I'll be making a lot of videos in the next little while, trying to catch up, because literally this is the first day I felt like I could actually talk. <laughs> Somewhat manly and husky, but I can talk. So uh, today we're gonna have Throwback Thursday. And uh, before we go any further, I do have a new nail polish on my nails. It is also from Essie, which I do tend to wear a lot of Essie nail polishes. This is Essie's Petal Pushers. Let's see, I'm sorry if you guys can't see this. Almost. There you go, Petal Pushers. This is a fabulous color. Another one of my favorite colors for fall and winter. All right, you guys. First of all, we have, we have Lisa 5 Ash to thank for selecting this week's Throwback Thursday. And this, thro this week's Throwback Thursday is Root Candles Mold Cider. Um, and as you can also see in the background here, you guys, I have switched up to Christmas. My tree is up. Uh, my tree, my decorations get started um, after the 11th, which for in Canada, it's called Remembrance Day. It's Veterans Day in the United States and many other places in, in the world. Um, but anyway, so I have gotten rid of all of my centerpiece for fall. And this is just something for, for winter. We have the, um, the deer there, some antlers, some deers over here, Santa, you know, all that fun stuff. Anyway, so... Again, I'm filming really late at night, so there's no natural light. It's just the way it is, unfortunately. Um, there'll be more videos of me behind the scenes, so maybe that's good for you guys. Anyway, so again, Lisa picked Root Legacy's Mold Cider. Now, keeping in mind, I was gifted this from my friend Josh. Their packaging has changed. They still have this fragrance on their website. It's more in a honeycomb shape, beautiful rose gold type packaging. It's a beautiful packaging. I think they did a fantastic overhaul on their packaging. Um, Root did in the last six months. I think it was fantastic. Before we go any further, I will tell you what Root or how Root describes this candle. Root describes this candle as a malt, oh sorry, combining warm cider, Macintosh apple, milling spice, green apple, precious woods, clove buds, and cinnamon. There's up to 24 hour burn time in this four ounce traveler tin, which is this size here. And this scent here, Mold Cider, is available on their website until the 31st of December of this year. Um, and again, I will, as always, in my description bar below, Root Candle has a discount code for 40% off your total. So again, if you find sale prices, it's 40% off sale prices and so on. So. I think this little tin was like $6 before the sale price. Um, fantastic, you guys. So anyway, before I go any further, again, this was gifted to me. I had not smelt this before ahead of time. I did not know what it would smell like. I love this candle. I have been waiting. I received this wonderful care package from Josh, which had an abundance of candles to try with amazing scents. This is my last, well, second to last one from him, or third. Well, it's the last travel tin. This is the very last travel tin I have. And I held on to this knowing that this would be perfect for fall. And that's why I put it into the fall throwback Thursday. So it is a four ounce candle up to 24 hour burn time. Sorry about the light, you guys. But there you go, you got this here. You can see there's like bubbling along the edges, which I absolutely love the bubbling that Root Candle does. I think it just shows its, it's like richness, um, it's just, it's, it's super awesome. I love the, uh, I love that effect. <coughs> pardon me. Okay, so you can, <coughs> pardon me. So you can see the caramel looking color of the wax and that's cool. And I haven't trimmed the wick yet. I will be trimming the wick prior to my next burn. 
Sorry, I think it's the wording in the Santa there that's getting it. Um, anyway, so that, I'll be, you know, I'll trim that again before I go to burn this. This is so amazingly potent, you guys. And I mean it in all the best sense of the words. <laughs> so when it says it's a combining warm cider, Macintosh, apple, 100%. This is probably even beyond vendor wax for me. And I have been into vendor wax for now for like nine months. Even with vendor wax, this is the most authentic mulled cider scent I have ever smelled. On cold, it smells identical when burning. I am absolutely over the moon about the scent. I cannot recommend this highly enough. This little travel tin, and I've, if you guys want to check out my root candle playlist, I probably have 14 or 15 candles on that playlist. And I, like I said before, Josh sent me a whole bunch of these awesome little travel tins. They burn really, really well. They throw amazing, at least like, I mean, this one's throwing really well. I had it in my kitchen. I could smell it through the whole great room. It was fantastic. So, sent a peel on cold when I received it. I liked it. I really enjoyed it. I thought nine. Perfect. Sent a peel when burning. Ten. Throw for this little four ounce candle, which even Bath & Body Works 14.5 ounce candles sometimes can't even give me half the amount of throw that I'm getting with this. I'm going to give the throw on this one a 9.5. <coughs> Sorry, you guys. I do apologize. This is an, very much a recommended candle. I highly suggest, well, and again, in my description bar below, I will have the, um, the, the discount code, which is actually ReviewerFall17. That's the code I was given. Um, I, it's been on every single one of my videos pretty much since I received um, some of the can since probably the beginning of November, or no, October, mid-October. Anyway. So you'll always see it there. So just if you forget or whatever, um, just go check out my description bar below. It doesn't, I'm not getting, I'm not affiliated with them. I'm not getting anything out of it. It's just more of a code that um, knowledge is power, get some things for gifts for Christmas. Fantastic. I cannot describe, I love this scent. This is beautiful. The packaging, like I say, in the new ones are much nicer. I like this, it's very masculine, it's very nice, but the new packaging is absolutely gorgeous play around with your cart i know the most expensive part about root really even with the sale and that is the shipping but if you go together with a friend and you know if you can go together with friends it's probably a lot easier i highly recommend this candle you guys it's probably one of my favorite root candles i've burnt and again this size is a four ouncer and it did so well unbelievable so thank you very much lisa for picking this candle out for this week's throwback Thursday and again on the website I believe this is six dollars American that's not including the 40% off so <coughs> my apologies so that's that for this particular candle review so we only have a couple more weeks left guys so I've only got two candles and three wax melts to pick so the first person down below to tell me or ask uh, which candle or which wax melt you'd like me to melt or burn um, please put that down below. I will acknowledge that and we will burn or melt your candle or your melt for next week. So we have Yankee Candles Home Classic Spice Cupboard. And we do have another root candle here. We have Root Legacy Blue Basil. Let's see if I get that in frame. And then onto the wax melts. We have Kirshner's Creations Pumpkin Pie Supreme Hippie Corn. Sassy Girl Aromas. Oops, sorry. <clears throat> see if we can get this into focus. Sassy Girl Aromas Sweet Potato Pie. Er, there we go. Sweet Potato Pie. Oops, sorry guys. And we have Destination Wax Zucchini Bread Apple Pumpkin. So that's it, you guys. I appreciate your patience. I will be making quite a few videos right now. I'm trying to catch up. I have so many things I haven't put away yet because I've been <coughs> without a voice. I still have a huge, um, yeah, anyway, I've got lots of big videos to do for you guys. So as always, you guys, take care, be safe, have fun, um, enjoy um, all that there is to enjoy the season. All right, you guys, until next week, talk to you later.